Good day, Paul Sterling here again from magicrelationship.net with a skill of the day. Basically, the website and all these videos are designed to help um, couples with compassionate communication skills. And as I said in an earlier video, and I've had this in almost every video, is if you want different results in your relationship, you're going to have to take different actions. If you want different actions, it's either change your beliefs or change your skills, change the actions. And today I'm going to get into um, relationship problems. How come they're recycled versus resolved? And I'm going to dive into that and give you some quick paradigm shifts. A paradigm basically is a way of looking at things, a belief. And one paradigm we had is the world was flat. And that paradigm kept us very limited for a long period of time. And once we realized the world was round, it changed the way we thought about navigation. So I want to change the way you think about relationship navigation. And um, I want to give you some tools that you can use right now. So I once heard this expression that a problem clearly defined is a problem half solved. Now, what I want you to do is think about your relationship problem. And most likely, the reason you're on this website watching these videos is because there are some problems. There are some results in your relationship that are different than what you want. And so you're going to have to take some different action. So let's clearly define a problem. What a lot of people would define a problem is like, my husband doesn't listen to me. Or my wife doesn't want to have sex as often as I want to. Now that's a problem that's pretty clearly defined, but the way that it's defined is that the only thing that's going to solve that problem is to change your partner, and it makes you basically a victim. Now, there's three things you can change. You can change your partner. You can, so that's number one here. You can change partners, which hopefully you're not at that point yet, but I know I've done it myself. I went through one divorce, two broken engagements, and that's basically where I ended up changing partners. Not a fun process. Or number three, you can change the way you relate or communicate with your partner. And that's the one we're going to focus on so that you're no longer a victim of your relationship. So let's look at if we can say the problem, state the problem in a slightly different way. Where we put you at the center of your problem, right there. Now, what's a different way of saying it that puts you at the center? Well, let's look at this. Rather than saying, my husband doesn't listen to me, I don't know how to communicate with my husband in a way that he enjoys listening to me. That's a subtle difference. Oh, hang on a second. Now that's called poor planning. My cell phone went off. So here I am. I'm back. I'm probably not even going to edit that out because I want you to see the human side of all of this. Anyway, so what I was saying is one way of saying it, my husband doesn't listen to me. That means the only way that you can change things is you've got to change your partner. But if you rewrite it and say, I don't know how to communicate or relate to my husband in a way that he enjoys listening to me, now you're in control. You are in control of the change. And you can learn new skills and learn how to change in a way and communicate in a way that he wants to. The same thing I said, my wife or my lover, my woman doesn't want to make love to me as much as I would enjoy. Well, that once again, it's about her. So if you change the problem statement is, I don't know how to ask my partner to make love to me in a way that excites her. Oh, I really didn't turn this off right. So now I'm learning how to communicate with my cell phone in a different way. So you get the basic idea. What this is, is go back to the beginning. A problem clearly defined is a problem half solved. So take a minute now and look at the problem that's happening in your, your relationship, the result that you've got that you don't want to have. 
and write it out in a way that puts you in the center of it. I don't know how to communicate in a way. I don't know how to resolve conflicts. I don't know how to clear up misunderstandings. I don't know how to talk about money or jealousy in a way that my partner doesn't take it personally. Or here's another one that's really interesting. I don't know how to, um, a lot of women just want to be listened to. And men have this tendency to instantly want to solve problems. So if you come to your man and they're all, and you're hurt, upset, unless you teach them how to communicate with you, they're instantly going to try to solve your problems. They're going to try to get you out of pain. So what we're trying to do here is give you some new communication skills so you can really get the results that you want. All right, that's it for this one. This one was all about getting clear on the problem because that's the stepping stone, the starting point. So this is Paul Sterling, magicrelationship.net. And this is a way to resolve problems rather than recycle them. And if you don't learn some new skills, your problems, you'll notice, get recycled. They'll come up again and again and again. And even if you change partners, a lot of times you change partners and they have the same problems. Why? Because you haven't learned new skills. Thanks. Have a great day. We'll see you on the next video.